Hello, welcome to how to solve this very nice system of equations a squared plus b squared is equal to 28 and a to the power 4 plus b to the power 4 is equal to 584. We need to find value of a cubed plus b cubed where a is greater than 0 and b is greater than 0. Now, first of all, we take square of both sides of this equation. a squared plus b squared is equal to 28 and we take square of both sides of this equation. And according to this algebraic identity, a plus b whole squared is equal to a squared plus b squared plus 2ab. This a squared plus b squared whole squared is equal to a to the power 4 plus b to the power 4 plus 2a squared b squared is equal to in this 28 squared this 28 squared is equal to 30 minus 2 whole squared. And this is equal to 30 square is 900 minus 2 times 30 times 2 plus 2 squared is 4. And this is equal to 900 minus 120 plus 4. And this is equal to 784. So, this 28 squared is equal to 784. Now, in place of this a to the power 4 plus b to the power 4, we put this value of a to the power 4 plus b to the power 4, 584. Value of a to the power 4 plus b to the power 4 is 584 plus 2a squared b squared is equal to 784. Now we move this 584 at the right side. 2a squared b squared is equal to 784 minus 584. Next, 2a squared b squared is equal to 784 minus 584 200 now from here we divide both sides of this equation by 2 so this 2 will be cancelled with this 2 and we get the value of a squared b squared is equal to 100 and this a squared b squared can be written as a b whole squared is equal to and this 100 can be written as plus or minus 10 squared and from here we take square root of both sides so this square will be cancelled with this square root and this square will be cancelled with this square root we get the value of a b is equal to plus or minus 10 from here a b is equal to 10 and a b is equal to negative 10 and because a is greater than 0 and b is greater than 0 so we reject this negative value negative 10 so the value of a b is 10 now according to this algebraic entry a plus b whole squared is equal to a squared plus b squared plus 2ab. Now by using this identity we can find the value of a plus b. In this identity we put the value of a squared plus b squared 28 from here like this a plus b whole squared is equal to value of a squared plus b squared is 28 plus 
2 times value of AB is 10. The value of AB is 10. Next, A plus B whole squared is equal to 28 plus 2 times 10, 20. And A plus B whole squared is equal to 48. Now, from here we take square root of both sides. So, this square will be cancelled with this square root and here left a plus b is equal to square root of we can write this 48 as 16 times 3. So, a plus b is equal to square root of 16 is plus or minus 4 times square root of 3. Now, from here we get uh, two values of a plus b. a plus b is equal to 4 times square root of 3 and a plus b is equal to negative 4 times square root of 3. And because a is greater than 0 and b is greater than 0, this uh, negative value will be rejected. So, the value of a plus b is 4 times square root of 3 and value of AB is equal to value of AB is 10 value of AB is equal to 10 now from here we can find the value of A cubed plus B cubed by using two methods by first method, we use this algebraic identity a cubed plus b cubed is equal to a plus b times a squared minus a b plus b squared. We can rearrange this as a cubed plus b cubed is equal to a plus b times a squared plus b squared minus a b. Now, in this equation, we put the value of a plus b 4 times square root of 3 and value of a b 10 and value of a squared plus b squared value of a squared plus b squared is equal to 28. So, this equation becomes a cubed plus b cubed is equal to value of a plus b is 4 times square root of 3 times value of a squared plus b squared is 28 minus value of a b is 10. Next, a cubed plus b cubed is equal to 4 times square root of 3 times 28 minus 10 18. Next a cubed plus b cubed is equal to 18 times 4 72 times square root of 3. This is the value of a cubed plus b cubed. This is the final answer of this equation. Now, we find this value of a cubed plus b cubed by using another method. In second method, we use this algebraic identity a plus b whole cubed is equal to a cubed plus b cubed plus 3ab times a plus b. In this identity, we put the value of a plus b 4 times square root of 3 and value of a b 10 from here and value of a plus b 4 times square root of 3 from here. Like this, value of a plus b 4 times square root of 3 cubed is equal to a cubed plus 
p cubed plus 3 times value of a b is 10 times value of a b 4 times square root of 3. Next cube of 4 is 64 times we can write this cube of square root of 3 as square root of 3 squared times square root of 3 is equal to a cubed plus b cubed plus 3 times 10 30 and 30 times 4 120 times square root of 3. Now this square will be cancelled with this square root and 64 times 3 192 times square root of 3 is equal to a cubed plus b cubed plus 120 times square root of 3. So we move this plus 120 times the square root of 3 at the left side. 192 times square root of 3 minus 120 times the square root of 3 is equal to a cubed plus b cubed. So from here we get the value of a cubed plus b cubed is equal to 192 minus 120 72 times square root of 3. So from this method we get the same answer 72 times square root of 3.